Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you doing today? Good evening, teacher. So-so. <laughs> so -so. Okay. Welcome. Welcome to um, this model number two. So I'm happy to be here. As you know, my name is Edith. Okay. Let me share my presentation. Okay. Let me see. Hello, my name is Brenda. Hi, Brenda. How are you today? So, so. So, so. Okay. Hello. Hello. Good evening. Can you see my screen? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay, very good. Okay, now it's better. Okay, today is May 20. I'm sorry. It's, it's May the 30th. I made mean, a, a, mis a mistake here. Yes, sir, it was 29. Okay, this is the model number two. Um, my name is Edith, okay, uh, my last name is Baires. Let me move on. Okay, we are going to discuss this in Spanish, okay? Vamos a discutir estas, um, bueno, esta información en español, pero luego voy a tratar eh, de hablar más en inglés porque Es muy importante, ¿ok? Ya que ustedes eh, están aquí porque quieren aprender inglés y tienen que tener contacto con el idioma lo más que se pueda para que ustedes puedan aprender, ¿ok? Eh, si tienen alguna duda, pregunta, algo que no me entiendan, eh, puedo hacer la excepción de, de mencionar algunas palabras en español Solo para aclarar. Okay. Let me see. We have 12. 12 students. Y en el grupo son 20. Okay. Okay. Um, es necesario obtener un 80% en promedio de tareas y evaluaciones para poder completar el curso satisfactoriamente. Las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma justo después de cada clase. A mí me gusta hacer las, las tareas eh, ya faltando 10 minutos para que termine la clase, para que no nos vayamos atrasando. Yo les doy tiempo. Por si tienen alguna duda, igual eh, estoy con ustedes al momento que ustedes están haciendo las tareas y vamos como al mismo nivel todos. Algunos, por supuesto, que se pueden adelantar si ustedes quieren, si tienen tiempo, pero no es obligación. Podemos ir a, al mismo nivel haciendo, digamos, en la clase 1, podemos hacer la tarea 1, mañana clase 2, al final de la clase hacemos la tarea 2. Y así sucesivamente. Ok. Todas las tareas de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completas antes de cada viernes a la medianoche, ya que ese registro es enviado a ISOFOR semanalmente. Las fechas de eje ejecución de este uh, nivel sería, será a partir de hoy, 30 de mayo al 26 de junio. En caso que por algún motivo se llegue a mover una clase, entonces pasa un, un día más. Digamos que movemos una clase en el, en, el, en el nivel, entonces terminaría el 27 de junio. ¿okay? Ah, la fecha límite para terminar el examen, bueno, el meter, que es el que se hace a, a, en medio, a medias de, del curso, es el 9 de mayo. El, y el examen final, el 3, el 3 de 
No, aquí creo que es el 23, perdón. Y aquí también tuve eh, 23, que es viernes de junio. Veamos. Veamos 23 de junio, es correcto. Ese día sería para el examen final. Ya solo nos quedaría una o dos clases para terminar el módulo. Ok, hay un manual. Eh, supongo que ustedes ya lo descargaron, ¿verdad? Manual que vamos no. a utilizar para este módulo. Si no lo ha descargado, yo le muestro luego cómo descargarlo, ¿ok? Vamos a ir haciendo también ejercicios de ese manual y basados en ese manual eh, vamos a ir um, también haciendo cada clase, ¿ok? Eh, requerimientos. Cuando usted va a entrar a la clase... Por favor, nombre completo al conectarse a la plataforma. En el caso que por algún motivo usted solo va a estar de oyente, eh, puede solicitar permiso y agregar la palabra oyente a la parte de su nombre, ¿ok? Para yo no estar llamándolo para que participe, porque uh, con, si usted tiene la palabra oyente, yo voy a saber que no puede contestar, no puede hablar, porque quizás este haciendo algo importante, ocupado, no sé, trabajando. Y yo voy a saber que solo está de oyente. Cámara encendida durante la sesión, ¿ok? Es importante que tenga la cámara encendida durante la sesión. Uh, yo sé que a algunos les cuesta mucho tener la cámara encendida, pero es uh, un requerimiento, ¿ok? Que pide INSAFOR, ya que las clases están siendo grabadas y... Eh, necesitamos ver que usted esté con cámara encendida, ¿ok? Porque muchas veces me ha pasado que eh, no tiene la cámara encendida. Yo le estoy hablando y parece ser que no está ahí a, eh, poniendo atención, sino que se, me, se va a hacer algo más y no, no tengo el control, ¿verdad? De, de que sí está o no está. Um, Minimizar el sonido ambiente lo más posible. Eh, sí, por ejemplo, eh, si usted no tiene ningún ruido en su casa, usted puede tener su micrófono abierto, no, ha, no habrá interferencia ni nada. Está bien, usted puede tener el, el micrófono abierto, participar en cualquier momento, ¿ok? Eh, pero si en caso no tiene el micrófono abierto, tiene el micrófono abierto, pero hay ruido, entonces sí voy a escuchar como interferencia. Quizás no deje que yo escuche a sus demás compañeros. Sin eso tenemos que respetar y ser un poquito cuidadosos, ¿ok? Participación activa. Sí, tiene que tener participación activa. Igual, eh, yo los hago que, que tengan una participación activa porque yo estoy preguntando, ¿ok? No se me escapan ahí. Eh, y si sí noto cuando nadie me quiere participar porque yo los llamo, los llamo. Y si no tengo respuestas porque eh, no me está participando, ¿verdad? No está activo. Uh, prácticamente esos serían los requerimientos y lo y, y importante. Puedo también mencionar la asistencia, eh, asistencia a las clases 100%. Cumplir con los 120 minutos de cada clase, ya que se genera asistencia por cada sesión. Y como la clase es grabada, el sistema automáticamente da cuántos minutos usted está activo en la clase. ¿Okay? La asistencia se toma en dos ocasiones. Eh, puedo tomar a las 10.20 la primera vez y la segunda vez a las 8.40. ¿Ok? Se tomará uh, como válida al escuchar el participante decir presente, ¿ok? Y tener cámara encendida. Si yo lo llamo y usted no me dice presente, entonces no le tomo asistencia porque voy a hacer cuenta que, que usted solo entró a la clase, pero no, no está prestando atención o está haciendo algo más, ¿ok? 
Eh, sesiones one on one, uh, disponibles cada, uh, por cada participante. Será asign asignado 10 minutos. Bueno, uh, yo siento que eso no es tan necesario, pero si alguien de ustedes necesita como un refuerzo, ok, dígame, hágame saber por, por el grupo o, o en privado y yo le doy 10 minutos al final para reforzar algo, aclarar dudas, ok. Uh, permisos no están disponibles. Pero si usted tiene una emergencia, pues puede avisar y solo para saber que va a faltar por esa emergencia, ¿verdad? No es porque se está retirando del curso. Ok. Eh, botón sil silencio, mute, cámara encendida. También puede participar en el chat. Eh, también vamos a tener uh, actividades en pequeños rooms. Uh, vamos a, a dividir eh, grupitos. Puede ser de pareja o tres o cuatro personas. Al, um, no sé si han trabajado eso antes, pero aquí sí lo vamos a trabajar. Si usted necesita ayuda, puede levantar su manita y le damos espacio para que usted haga su pregunta. Y bueno, respeto ante todo, ¿verdad? Eso es lo que pido. Respeto a sus compañeros, hacia mí, hacia todos, para que um, no haya ningún, bueno, ningún, ninguna llamada de, aten de, de atención por eso. Tenemos en el chat un chat de Griselda. Ok, Griselda estará de oyente mientras llega a casa. Está bien. Ok. Uh, muy bien. Déjenme ver. Ok, ah, también tareas y evaluaciones. Semana 1, que es de hoy, del, del 30 de mayo al 2 de junio. Ok, semana 2, sección 2, del 5 al 9 de junio. Um, semana 3, la sección 3, del 12 al 16 de junio. Y la semana 4, sección 4 y examen final del 19 al 26 de junio. Ok, esas son las tareas que vamos a ir completando. Cada sección, tenemos cuatro secciones, eh, una por cada semana. Y en la semana dos que tenemos el midterm y en la cuatro que tenemos el final exam. Ok. Uh, ¿Tienen alguna pregunta de esto? ¿No? Ok. Yo sí, teacher. Ok, Brenda. Uh, yo no he podido accesar a la plataforma. No sé, no, no pude. No pudo. Y la, eh, el nivel 1, sí. O sea, no tuvo ningún problema. Trabajó bien en la plataforma. Ajá, sí, me, es que me aparece uh, curso archivado, me parece. Me imagino que es el módulo pasado pero ya Tiene no me permite que... actualizar. Oh, entiendo. Tiene que entrar con el link nuevo que le enviaron por correo. Ahí le dieron el link para que usted entrara a, a la plataforma. No sé si ha intentado con ese nuevo link. Sí, lo que sucede es que el link lo recibí en el teléfono y la plataforma la habilito desde la compra. Uh, ok, puede, puede enviarse el link por medio de WhatsApp al, um, y ahí sí lo puede abrir en la compu o, o abrir el correo directamente en la compu, ¿verdad? Como le salga mejor. Okay. Eh, sí, al final vamos a dedicar unos 15 a 10 minutos para que todos eh, me confirmen que pueden accesar a la plataforma o si no, pues explico paso a paso para que lo puedan hacer. Y vamos a hacer la primera tarea, ¿ok? Al final de la clase. Ok. Good. Uh, ¿Alguien más que tenga preguntas? ¿No? No. no ok. Puedo. Muy bien. Continuamos. Ok. Ok, we have an agenda for today. 
So first we have the course introduction, que ya lo tuvimos. And then we have the list of objectives. And then you will introduce yourself. Um, just a short uh, presentation. You can say your name, uh, the place where you live, what, what do you like to do, where do you work, okay? Um, basic information about you, okay? And then we're going to describe regular activities in the workplace, okay? We're going to speak about what you do in your workplace. Then we have a conversation to practice, okay? Okay, the objectives for this lesson, the first one is that you introduce yourself, okay, to the rest of the class, then describe regular activities in the workplace, okay? Those are the objectives for this lesson. Okay, first we're going to introduce uh, ourselves. Um, here I have an example. For example, this this is just a conversation to give you ideas to, to introduce yourself, okay? We can do that uh, as a conversation, okay you can you can do it with one of your classmates or you can do it by yourself okay if you do it for example if brenda do it with manuel Ma brenda um will start this is just an example she will start like saying hi my name is brenda how are you today or what is your name? And Manuel will say, I am Manuel. It is nice to meet you, Brenda. Nice to meet you too. I'm sorry. What is your last name again? It is Garcia. Oh, yes, it is Garcia. Thank you. And your last name? Your last name is Gomez, right? Yes, it is Gomez. Thank you. Thank you, Manuel. Have a good night. Okay, this is just an example, okay? But if you want okay. to do it alone, if you want to do it alone, you can say, hi, good evening, everybody. My name is uh, Isabel. Um, I work in, you can say, the place where you work. I am 20 years old. Um, I like listen to music. Uh, my favorite food is pizza, for example. Um, basic information about you, okay? So you decide if you want to do it alone or you want to do it with someone else. Volunteers, like uh, I can ask if you want to be a volunteer, just raise your hand. So levante la manita que tiene ahí. Yo voy a saber si quiere ser voluntario, okay? Okay. If no, I will start calling one by one. I will go to the list. What do you prefer? <laughs> Teacher, I va a poner la conversación ahí porque yo solo miro uno o dos cactus. Oh, no estoy compartiendo. Okay. Let me see. Pueden ver mi pantalla a uh, los demás o no? No. Mm, that is weird. Let me try it again. What about now? Mm. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, I'm really sorry. Yes. I was hearing I was sharing this presentation. I don't know why it was not working. But now, yes, this is the conversation. So you can follow um, this uh, example. Okay, just let me open the attendance list. Okay, here. Your attendance list. Okay. Okay, uh, 
Do you want to be volunteers or quieren que yo lo seleccione? Yeah. Uh -huh. What do you prefer? ¿Qué prefieren? <laughs> Solo deberíamos a leer el texto. No, no tanto a leer porque ustedes ahí donde están los espacios there is information that there is information that you are going to add que ahí van a agregar información no es ajá this is just like a guide solo es una guía para que ustedes eh, tengan una idea yes? Okay, volunteers, who wants to be the first one? Okay, well, let me, uh, let me call your names. Um, Astria Abigail, is she here? Está ella aquí? Yes or no? No, right? Astri Abigail. Abigail. No. Okay. Aide. Liz. Aide Romero de Guzmán. No. Okay. Brenda Elizabeth. Present. Seron Garcia. Okay, Brenda, you will be the first one. Do you want to do, to do it alone or with someone else? Solita o con alguien más, Brenda? Sola. <laughs> okay, alone. Okay, go ahead. My name is Brenda Elizabeth Seron Garcia. I am Salvadorian. Okay. Um, uh, I work in Hiboa, Confección of Hiboa. Okay. I live in Santiago Nonualco. I am 44 years old. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Brenda. Okay, Selina, Selina Janet Arevalo. Present teacher. Hi, Selina. Hi. Do you want to do it alone or with someone else? Con alguien más. Okay. Good. Uh, Diana Carolina Durán. Presente. Okay, Presente. Diana. Okay, Diana. Do you want to, to do a conversation do you, with um, Selena? Okay. Okay, go ahead. Hi, my name is Selena Arevalo. Hi, I am uh, Diana Carolina Melendez. It is like to you meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am sorry. What is your last night again? It's it is Melendez. Yes. It is Yeah, it is. <laughs> yes, it is Melendez. It is Melendez. Thank you. Uh, your last name is Alfaro, right? No, 
it is Arevalo. Yeah. Then you. Uh, then you. Uh, thank you, Griselda. Okay, good. Okay. Nice to meet you. Okay, when, when you said it is nice to meet you, está diciendo, eh, gusto en conocerte, right? Nice to meet you. It is nice to meet you. Okay. It what is, is nice your, to meet you. Yes, what is your last name again? ¿Cuál es tu nombre? Otra vez. Okay, what is your last name again? What is your last your last name, name is Miguel. again. Name. Again. Okay. Very good. Okay. So, well, thank you so much, both of you. We're going to continue. Now will be Evelyn Del Carmen. Present. Okay, Evelyn, do you want to introduce yourself alone or with someone else? Ah, con alguien más. Okay. Griselda Jamilet. Okay. Griselda. No, it's not here. Um, Isabel Rocio. Present. Isabel Rocio. Okay, Isabel. Do you want to introduce yourself with um, Evelyn? Yes. It's okay. Okay, go ahead. Hi, my name is Evelyn Garcia. Hi, Evelyn. My name is Isabel Rocio. It's nice to meet you, Isabel. Nice to meet you, too. Uh, I'm sorry. What is your last name again? It is Vasquez. Yes. It is Vasquez. Yes. Ah, yes. Yes. You your last name is is Melendez? No. My last name is Garcia. Thank you. Mm, I know how to Okay, thank you. Have a good night, you can say. <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, Karen Patricia. Karen. Karen Patricia. No. Lillian Elizabeth. Lillian. No. Okay. Uh, Luis. Américo Rivas. Here, teacher. Hi. Good evening, Liz. Uh, do you want to introduce yourself alone or with someone else? Alone. Alone. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, hello. My name is Luis Américo Rivas Martinez. I am Salvadorian. I am... 37 years old. I live in San Luis La Herradura. Uh, I am a soy trainer. I have two sons. I work in Convection de Jihua. Uh, my favorite place is in town uh, at, the, at the park. Okay. <laughs> Only that? Uh, that. Okay, excellent. That was good. Very good. Thank you. Okay, Manuel Alexander. Present teacher. Okay, Manuel, uh, do you want to introduce yourself alone or with someone else? For one name. Someone else. Okay. Uh, Natalie? Marilyn? Natalie? 
Present teacher. Okay, good evening. Natalie, do you want to introduce yourself with Manuel? Oh, good. Okay, go ahead. Hi, my name is Manuel Peña. Hi, I am Natalie Marilyn Sort. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am sorry, what is your last name again? It's Sorto. Yes, it is Sorto. Thank you. Your last name is Peña, right? Yes, it's Peña. Thank you. Hi, a good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Okay. Have a good night. Good. Thank you so much. Okay. Oscar Eliseo. Are you there? Oscar? No? Okay. Roberto Antonio? Present. Hi, Robert. How are you doing today? Okay. 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 Do you want to introduce yourself? I mean, by you alone or with someone else? Uh, myself. Okay. Go ahead. Okay. My name is Roberto. I'm. My last name is Guzman. I'm thirty-two years old, and I live in Santiago Norwalco. I. Uh, I work at uh, Confecciones Pedregal. Um, only that. Okay. I work. I work at Confecciones Pedregal. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Roberto, thank you. Okay. Sandra Yamilet. Present teacher. Hi, Sandra. Do you want to introduce yourself alone? Or with one of your classmates? Hello. Hello. Okay, go ahead. Hi. My name is Sandra. My last name Alvarado. I'm 29 years old. I live in La Paz. I work Confecciones El Pedregal. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Very good, Sandra. Thank, Thank you. you. Veronica? Veronica Guadalupe? No here? Okay. Uh, when did you did? Present teach. Hi, you did. Okay. Do you want to introduce yourself with someone else or alone? Hello. Okay, go ahead. Hi, my name is Judith. I am 24. And my last name is Marroquín. I work in Confecciones El Pedregal. I live in Tepecoyo. Okay, very good. You say you that you are 24 years old? Yes. Okay. Good. Thank you. Uh, Judith. Okay. Xiomara Elizabeth. Present teacher. Hi, Xiomara. Hi. Okay. Let me see if Janira is here. Janira, hello. No, she's not here. Okay. So go ahead, Sandra. Teacher. Yes. It's alone. Yes, you will do it alone because uh Janita yes, is not yes. here. Mm -hmm. Yes. And hi, my name is Sumar Ramos. I am 31 years old. I work at HBI. I am ready for place. I live in La Paz. La Paz. Okay. Good. 
Very good. good. Thank you so much. Jen, uh, Thank you. Sarah. Okay. Okay. Welcome, everyone. Okay. Welcome. And I hope that uh, we learn together. Okay. Let me see. Is someone missing? Me falta alguien. Olivia says she is just listening to us. Lillian Elizabeth, Cuellar. Lillian Elizabeth Cuellar. Okay, well, maybe tomorrow, Lillian, you can introduce yourself. Okay, who else? King Mass is, is here. ¿Qué más que no ha pasado? Ajá. I have 14, 14 students. From 20. Six are missing. Four, five, six. Okay, remember mute yourself, okay? If you have uh, if you are um talking talking with someone else, please mute. Mute yourself. Um if there is noise in your house and your microphone is open, please uh mute, okay? Good. Thank you so much. Okay, I have a game here we're going to make a review about present uh, simple present okay okay i live or lives in st helens which bird is the correct which one do you think live live okay, okay. Very good. It doesn't need the letter S, right? Because it's not third person. Okay, he live or lives in St. Helens? Lives. Live. Okay, because he's third person. Okay, very good. My cat likes to eat fish. Or they like to eat fish, or my cat likes to eat fish. Which one is correct? My cat. My cat. Let us see. Okay, my cat likes to eat fish. Okay, very good. She had a, a kitten or neither or they how would be the correct one which one is the correct she have a kid they they have a kitten Okay. Hey, why, why, um, they, Not. why we're going to use they? Hmm? They, 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 they have a kitchen. Kitten. Kitten. You're right, it is kitchen. Kitten. Okay. They have a kitchen. Yes, yes. Because it, we are using have. Okay, that is why. Very good. Okay, we like or like Liverpool. We like. 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 We like. We like. Okay. Very good. Okay. Play. play or place? Play. 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 Or place? Play. Play. Place. 
right? Because this is the third person. It could be she or he. I don't know if that is for a woman or man. That, that is a third person, okay? I dancing. Ali doesn't like pasta or they doesn't like pasta? Which one is correct? They. Ali doesn't like pasta. Ali, right? Because this is a third Ali. person. Uh -huh. We are going to make a review with this, okay? Just to clarify when we're going to use... Uh, when we're going to use the, the third person. Okay. He, we, or they go to the cinema. He, he, he. Okay. Very good. She co She likes or she like coffee and biscuit. She, she likes. Like. She likes. She likes. Okay, because it's third person. Very good. Okay, my cat or he or my cat like to play. Uh -huh. My cat. My, my cat. cat. My, my cat like to play. My cat. Okay. Uh -huh. Very good. Nadia, green or green coffee? Green. Drink. 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 Okay. Because it's third person, right? Very good. We, or Frankie, or Holly and Harris, is from Hong Kong? We. We, Frankie. Frankie. Frankie, right? Because if if that is we, we'll, we'll, we'll be are. We are, mm -hmm. right? But in this case, it's okay. third person. That will be me. Okay. My is from Hong Kong. Wow. Okay, very good. We have here the answers. Do you have questions about this? We're going to, to do a review. Yeah, we're going to make a review about this um how to use the third person okay simple present then but if you have questions about these sentences please let me know no okay let me move on Okay, here we have the simple present tense. This is a review. We have in positive form and also we have negative form. Okay, in positive form, uh, we are going to have subject plus verb plus uh, S, E, S, or I, E, S. We're going to add that to the verb if that is necessary. For example, with the third person, that is he, she, and it, the verb will, uh, will be with letter S in this case that did it, this is start. But it, there are other cases that the verb will end with E, S, I E S. Okay. We're going to see the different verbs. But we're going to see the, the rules, how to apply this. Okay. Uh, for I, you, we, you, they, the verb will be in, in the formal way. It doesn't have um another letter. Okay. Will be just in the formal way. In the formal written way okay remember just for three three of them that is he she and it third person okay tercera persona solo para estos tres we're going to change the verb here we're going to add 
S, E, S, or I, E, S. It depends on the verb. Okay? For example, I like it. Okay? I like it. If that is in third person, she likes, mm -hmm. she likes, she likes, okay? Do you have questions about this? Let me know, please, if you have questions. ¿Tienen alguna pregunta? ¿Cómo utilizar eh, verbo normal y cuando cambia el verbo? Do you have questions? Please let me know, okay? Dígame, sin pena. Va no? a cambiar el verbo cuando sea en tercera persona. He, she, it. Correct. Mm -hmm. Y va a depender del verbo si le agregamos solo S, uh -huh. yes, uh -huh. or, or I, yes. Va a depender del verbo. Luego uh -huh. les voy a enseñar las reglas de cuáles verbos y cómo aplica. ¿Ok? This is positive form. ¿Ok? What about negative form? Ok, in this case, will be the same. Uh, he, she, it. In this case, will be das. Does, does not, or it could be doesn't, okay? It is the same. Just the, the way that it changed is how you're going to write that. Does not or doesn't. And the verb in this, the verb will be in the same, the same way here, okay? The negativo no va a la No. It is, a, it is normal way. Uh, does not be doesn't is correct in, in, in the three verbs. Just for these three subjects, he, she, and he. Mm -hmm. For I, you, we, you, and they, we're going to use do. Do not or don't. Yes. Mm -hmm. This is abbreviation and this is normal. Do not normal and don't or it doesn't abbreviation. Okay. And the verb is, is in the normal form. Example, I do not like it or I don't like it. Okay, you can use do not or don't. With third person, she doesn't or she. Oh, she does not or she doesn't like it. This is just an example, okay? Do you have okay. questions about this? Yes? Please let me know if you have questions. Is it clear? Yeah. Yes? Okay, yes. good. Okay. Um, here we have another example. Okay, but just let me... Oh, yes, this is the correct video. GoEnglish.tv but I, I cannot reprodu reproduce that video now. Okay, I will send a link to you. Porque yo no lo puedo reproducir, okay? Porque el, el video es subido a YouTube and that it is not allowed. No, lo, no es permitido por derechos de autor. But let me send a link to you to the chat in order you can check it. It has, let me see how long. <clears throat> Almost 
five minutes. Okay, go ahead and, and play the video. Okay, from now, just play the video. Okay, ya está el minuto. Tres, tres cuarenta, ok. Hasta ahí, hasta ahí véanlo. Luego vamos a dejar el otro pedacito para después, que es cómo hacer preguntas. Se los mandé al chat. Ah, de, de aquí, ahorita, no en WhatsApp. Se los mandé al chat de Zoom. ¿Pueden todos accesar ahí? Mejor al chat de, de WhatsApp, mándenlo. Ok, let me, let me do it. Okay, I already sent it to the to the WhatsApp group. English.tv Solo hasta el minuto 3.36, 3.40, ok? Hasta ahí lleguen. Lo vamos a adelantar al minuto tres treinta y tres, teacher. No, lo van a ver del, del 0 al 3.30, al 3.30, no, permítame. Sí. 3.33 dijo 3.40. Ajá, Ajá 3.36, 3.40. Oh, Ahí. está bien. Ok. Conjugating the present simple affirmative.
Teacher. Yes. A qué minuto dijo? Three or three four seconds. Ready? Ya lo Ready. ya llegaron hasta ahí. Uh, hasta ahí. Yes. Sí. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, there you have more examples, okay? Yes. Do you have questions? Do you have questions for positive and negative form? No. No? No. Okay. Okay. Good. So in that case, we're going to apply what you know so far. Okay, we have here another example. For example, okay, he plays soccer. That is positive. Negative will be he doesn't play soccer. Okay. They eat breakfast at 8 a.m. Okay. Negative. They don't eat breakfast at 8 a.m. Okay. If I say um, Griselda, Griselda eat breakfast at 8 a.m. How will be the negative form, Brenda? If I say Griselda eat breakfast at 8 a.m., tell me the negative sentences. Mm -hmm. Who wants to help? Griselda doesn't eat breakfast at 8 a.m. Okay, very good. Yes, Griselda doesn't eat breakfast at 8 a.m. Okay, good. If I say, um, Xiomara plays video games. How will be the mm. negative form, uh, Roberto? He play play so plays video well. She doesn't Roberto. play. Uh -huh. She doesn't, okay. Uh -huh. She doesn't, so play. doesn't play video, video games. Game. Okay. Thank you. Okay, if uh, if I say Sandra, Sandra works from Monday to Friday. How will be negative? Repítame, por favor. Sandra works from Monday to Friday. Um, no le Sandra doesn't work. Mm -hmm. Negative four. Sandra doesn't work. Negative four will be Sandra doesn't doesn't work from Monday to Friday. Okay. Si la oración positiva es que ella trabaja de lunes a viernes, la negativa es que ella no no trabaja de lunes a viernes. Okay. Sorry if you hear a noise here. Lo siento si escuchan un ruido. Okay. Um, we're going to continue. We have here. We have here a uh, two short paragraph. Okay. 
we're going to select the correct verb. Vamos a seleccionar el verbo correcto. See, my family and I. Yes. Hi, bye bye. Mm. Okay, just a moment, please. Let me see. Uh, okay. Oh, yes. Okay. My family and I live or lives? Live. 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 Okay. Live. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, it's not the one that I want. Okay, permítanme que me quiero un lápiz, pero no me funciona. Well, we're good. Leave. My family and I leave. That will be the correct one. Okay. In the sovereign. Okay. Sorry, I want to change the color because it uh, it doesn't work. I see. Yes, my family and I live in uh in the suburbs. My wife and I mm -hmm, work or works. Works. Remember that is including my wife. Está, está incluyendo su, su esposa y él. Work. 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 Just work, right? Work. Near here. So, we? We are. No, what, 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 our daughter Emily work or works? Work. 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 Okay. Work. Because she is third person. Okay. We are talking about she. Work. Downtown. So she drive or drive to work? Drive. 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 She drives. Right? She drives to work. Our son don't or doesn't. Doesn't drive. Doesn't. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay, my son doesn't doesn't drive. He Ride or ride his bike to school. Right. 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 He rides. 
he rides his bike to school. Okay. My parents live or live? Live. Live. Because we are speaking about two. We are speaking about they, right? They live in the city. My mother take or take? Take. Take. My mother takes a train to work. My father is retired. So he don't or he doesn't work now? He doesn't. Okay. He doesn't. It doesn't work now. He also use or uses? Use. Uses. Uses. Uh -huh. uses. uses. Public transportation. So they, they don't or they doesn't need us. They don't. They don't. Uh -huh. they, don't. Dumb, dumb. they don't need a car. Okay, very good. Okay, my family and I live in the suburbs. My wife and I work near here, so we walk to work. Our daughter Emily works downtown, so she drives to work. Our son doesn't drive, he rides his bike to school. My parents live in the city. My mother takes a train to work. My father is retired, so he doesn't work now. He also uses public transportation, so they don't need a car. Okay, very good. A car. Who wants to read the two short paragraphs? I need volunteers. It's para leerlo, teacher. Yes, just read. Okay, lo intentaré. Okay, Samara, thank you. Uh, my family is a live in the suburbs. My wife e I work near here, so we walk to work. Or they no, esa no la puedo pronunciar. They right, right. Right. M Emily works down downtown, so she drives the world. Her son, her son doesn't drive. He rides his bike to school. My parents lie in the city. My mother takes. Uh, train to work. My father is right here, right So he don't, doesn't work up. He, he also uses public transportation. So, so they don't, don't need a car. <laughs> okay. Thank you so Finish. much. Thank you so much. Okay. Um, yes, you you will improve, okay? Uh, we're going to practice again. It says, my family and I live in the suburbs. My wife and I work near here. So, we walk to work. Our daughter, Emily, works downtown. So she drives to work. Our son doesn't drive. He rides his bike to school. Okay. My parents live in the city. 
My mother takes train to work. My father is retired, so he doesn't work now. He also uses public transportation, so they don't need a car. Okay. Who wants to, to read it? Okay, who wants to try? Huh? Volunteers? Okay, Roberto, go ahead. Me. Hi. Hi, go ahead. Okay. My family and I, what? My family and I live in two boards. My wife and, and I work near here. So we walk to work. Our daughter, our daughter aims to work. Our son doesn't drive. He rides his bike to school. Number two, my parents sleep. To work. My father is retired, so she uses public transportation so they don't need a car. Okay, thank you so much. Do you have questions about the vocabulary that you can see here? For example, sovereign, do you know what is the meaning? It is a residential area, okay, where there are a lot of houses, okay? Um, what else? Do you know what is downtown? Uh-huh. Someone? Downtown. Do you know what is that? Downtown. Uh, centro de la ciudad. Yes. Uh -huh. Very good. Like, uh, it is like uh, the business and the commercial area in the town, right? Okay, what else? Do you have another word here? Do you know all the all of them? Do you know all the words? Uh, sub suburbs. Suburbs? It is like a residential area. Suburbs. Yes. Mm-hmm. It is um, where there are a lot of houses, residential, okay? Okay, what else? Do you have another word? No? Okay, we're going to continue. Vamos a continuar. Okay. Um, okay. How can you form yes or no questions? Study the boxes below. Vamos a, vamos a hacer un repaso. How to make questions, okay? How to form questions. Do you remember the verb to be, right? Les enseñaron a, a usar el verbo to be, cómo hacer eh, positive and negative sentences and questions. 
So now we are going to, if you don't remember or uh, if you didn't receive like uh, examples of the verb to do, now we're going to, to, to review that, okay? About the verb to do. So when we use the verb to be, we know that we use am, um, are, and is, okay? It depends on the subject, okay? For example, am I a student, okay? That is one question. Are you a student, okay? Or are we students? Are we busy? Are they at school? Are they busy? Okay. Now with third person, she is she busy or is she a student? Is he a student? Is she uh, busy? So we have different examples here. Okay. Um, is it busy? It could be an animal, could be a cat, I don't know. Is it busy? Okay. So examples how to make questions. First is the bird to be, then the subject, and then the noun, verb, ing, or preposition or adjectives. This is like the complement, okay? But that this is the way that are form, okay? Also, we have yes, no questions. Well, these are the yes, no questions. The answer will be yes or not. The answer will be yes or not. Okay, yes, I am. Yes, you are. Yes, we are. Yes, they are. Or yes, he is. Yes, she is. Yes, it is. Okay. If that is positive, if that is negative, no, I'm not, no, you are not, no, we are not, no, they are, they are not. If that is with third person, no, she's not, no, he's not, no, it's not, okay? This is the bird to be. Do you have questions about this, the bird to be? Please let me know. This is just to review, okay? Solo para recordar. Eso ustedes ya lo tuvieron que ver en el nivel 1. Okay. And this, yes, también, but, but we are um, working on that. I don't know. Si ¿Sí lo vieron en el nivel 1, el ver to do? Yeah. Yes. Okay, very good. So here we have. Do or does, okay, that is the auxiliary, subject, and the verb, okay? Do I study? Do you study? Do they study, okay? Does she study? Does he study? Or does it study? Okay, well, in this case, it doesn't apply because... um. It is weird. Sería extraño que le preguntaran que si... Eso sería como un objeto, un animal estudia, right? Okay. Yes, to give answers. Yes, I do. Yes, you do. Yes, we do. Yes, they do. Yes, he does. Yes, she does. Yes, he does. Okay, positive and negative. No, I don't. No, you don't. No, we don't. No, they don't. No, he's... He doesn't, no, she doesn't, and no, he doesn't, okay? That is the difference between the verb to be and the verb to do. And how to know how to make equations if using the verb to be or the verb to do? ¿Cómo vamos a ver qué, qué usar? Si el verbo to be o el verbo to do? So that will depend of the, um, Va a depender del escenario, ¿ok? En el que usted se encuentre. Usted tiene que saber uh, identify, identificar which verb you're going to use, if the verb to be or the verb to do to make questions. Eso puede ser un poco confuso, 
Pero la práctica, más que todo, es la que ustedes eh, le va a facilitar identificar si va, va a usar el verbo to be o el verbo to do para hacer una pregunta. ¿Ok? ¿Questions about this? ¿Preguntas? ¿Yes? No. Ok. Ok. Ok, por ejemplo, aquí tenemos 11 sentences. We have these sentences in present tense. Ok, we're going to select the correct form. Vamos a seleccionar de la, la forma correcta, ok. <clears throat> ok. Will be um, do or does. Sound like suit. Does. 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 Okay. Does. Does. Okay. Um, I don't or I I doesn't like football. I don't, I don't like. Football. I don't like. I don't like football. Okay. I don't like football. Do or does you want bread? Do you want bread? Do you want bread? Do you want bread? Okay. Can don or doesn't like watching TV? Karen, Karen does That's right. Mm -hmm. Do or does your father like watermelon? Do, 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 do your father. Do your father. Like do or does? Do. Remember do. that we are talking does about it. one one person. Does. That is he. Does. Does. Analicen does. eso. Analicen de quién mm -hmm. estamos hablando. Si es una persona o más de dos. No necesariamente vamos a decir he or she. Podemos decir uh, un nombre, podemos decir uh, una forma diferente que se le pueda llamar a esa persona, pero si estamos hablando about your father, is he, right? Does your father like watermelon? Mm -hmm. Do or Don't. does you want meatball? Do. 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 Okay. Do. Mm -hmm. Does. What do or what does what, your mom like? What does 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 Michael don't don or doesn't does. like salad? Doesn't doesn't okay. Do or does Anna like apples? Does 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 doesn't okay. Jamie don or doesn't like grapes? Hmm? Jamie, Don or doesn't like grapes? Doesn't, doesn't like grapes. Doesn't. Like grapes. doesn't. Okay. Do or does children like vegetables? Do. Does. 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 Remember, children. ¿Qué significa children? Niño. 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 ¿Es, ¿Es plural niño. o es singular? ¿No? Nos referimos es singular. A un, singular. ¿A un niño o a madre? Plural. Es plural. Plural, ¿verdad? Sí. Entonces plural. sería do or that. Do that. Do that. Do that children. Do, right? Because it's a group of... of uh, Children in this case. Do children like vegetables? Okay, very good. Do you have questions about the vocabulary here? Preguntas de vocabulario? Yes? Mom. What is mom? Mom. mom. It is to say like a mom. Uh, se puede escribir de las dos formas. Mamá, right? 
Mm. Mm. What else? Um, uh, show. It's the sound like show. This. Um, like show. Which number? Yes. What number? Oh, uh, oh. Number one. Okay. It's up. Up. Oh. So. Do you know what is meat meatballs? Meatballs. Do you? Meatball. Son las tortitas de carne, okay? Ah. Yes. Serio. Meatballs. <laughs> Do you like meatballs? Ya de nuevo para mí. Tenemos las meatballs, vamos a decir. Ajá. Si tiene cuando cuando ustedes um Hacen espagueti. Espinaca. Uh -huh. Cuando ustedes hacen espagueti, pueden um, agregarles meatballs. Ah. Meatballs. Como, como picada. Uh -huh. meatballs. Pero ustedes hacen las tortitas, ¿no? Las no. tortitas. Sí, nosotros lo que cocinamos, cabrón. <risa> Okay. Okay, sorry, I have to delete this. My yes, dinner, my dinner, my lunch. Yes. Okay, very good. Meatballs. Okay, now we're going to use questions with the door das here. But let me, oh yeah, okay, let me. No veo la letra, tucha. Okay, I will do it bigger, just a moment. La voy a hacer más grande, okay? Pero. Ahora sí. Yes. Okay, we're going to add do or does. Do Peter live with his father or does Peter live with that? That's Peter. Okay. Live. Do. Okay. Do. Or that? Do. 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 Do you learn Spanish? No. No. Do or that? Andrew and Martin ride their bags. Do. 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 Because we are talking about, we're talking about Andrew and Martin. So there are two, two people. So it means that they were speaking about they, right? <laughs> Okay, analyze, analyze and bien. Okay, you recite just to just one or two. Mm -hmm. Okay, do or dance, they play in the do. garden. Do. 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 do or dance, and this hamster living in the, in the cage. Das. Das. Okay, very good. Do or dance. The cat sit on the wall. Does. Does. Mm -hmm. No. Pay attention here. Mm. Cat or cat? Do, 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 do. Because that is plural, right? Okay. Mm. Do or does. We work in front of the computer. Do. Do. Do we work? Uh -huh. Do you play do. the drums? Do, play the drums. do, do. with do. us. Do. 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 do or that is the we're uh full hours. That's that's do or that I clean the bathroom. Do 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 I clean do. the bathroom? Okay, very good. Um 
Do you have questions about this? No question. Pullover, what is? Do you want to know what is pullover? It is a piece of cloth, usually made by warm material. Es una pieza de ropa, ¿ok? Está hecha como de material caliente. Mm -hmm. Okay, all of them are good. We have a hundred percent. Okay, very good. Good job. Hmm? Hmm. Okay, now I'm going to explain the third person simple present ending with S, E, S, and I, S. Okay? Pay attention, please. Pay attention. Okay, there are a lot of verbs, as you may know. Y eso es como una tarea que quiero que ustedes se tomen, pero ustedes, ¿verdad? De aprenderse por lo menos uno o dos verbos diarios, okay? Memorize, okay? Because that will help you a lot. That will help you to increase, improve your vocabulary, okay? Okay, all the verbs ending with V, C, E, G, I, J, K, M, N, P, Q, T, U, W. Examples, work, Stay, no, sit, see, and live. All of them will we what we are going to do is add the letter S. Only letter S. Okay. If the verb ends with vowel letters, si termina con el vowel letters, I E, sorry, A E I O U, followed by Y. We add S. Ok, si termina con cualquier vocal, pero va después de, de una Y, le agregamos también la letra S. For example, say, buy, enjoy, convey. Ok, solo le agregamos una S. Son reglas que ustedes tienen que memorizarse y saber. Ok. If we have the exception, the verb have, a, have and has. Aquí que este totalmente cambia. Okay? Es ir, irregular. Um, have, cuando no es tercera persona, and has, cuando es tercera persona. We're talking about when we add the letter S. En este grupo. And we have another group here. ES. They're ending in, in uh, sounds like uh, okay, S, Z, H, like sh, or X, R, E, S. For example, we have push, termina en SH, cash, en CH, fix, en okay. Confet, confess, and double S. Finish, C H. Thus, okay. We add E S. Estos que terminan con estos sonidos, we add E S. Okay. Dale atención para que ustedes apliquen las reglas correctas when you are speaking. And when you use these verbs, okay? When the verb end with uh, one S or Z, or Z, okay, que es la Z, we double the letter S or Z, or Z and add E. For example, quiz, quizzes. Doblamos la Z y le agregamos ES. The verb with O, el verbo go, goes. Okay. 
Le agregamos, le agregamos ES. Uh, when we are going to add IES. ¿Cuándo le vamos a agregar eso a los verbos? We are talking about just verb in present, ok? Present tense. Simple present, ok? Solo lo estamos hablando del tiempo presente, ok? Very ending with consonants. And why? Change why for I, E, S. For example, cry. We add I, E, S. Le cambiamos, le quitamos la I griega. Y le agregamos la I normal latina, E, S. Ok. Cries. Fly. Flies. Try. Tries. Hurry. Hurries. Imply. Implies. Deny, denies, copy, copies, apply, applies, study, studies. Eso es bien fácil esta regla, ¿ok? Todos los verbos que terminan con consonante, primero consonante, y luego la Y, le quitamos la Y y le agregamos I, E, S. Pero si termina con vocal y y que son están en este otro grupo, por ejemplo, pay, solo le agregamos s, pays, buys. Okay. Do you have questions about this? Recuerde que esto aplica solo para las terceras personas. Preguntas? Please let me know if you have questions. Do you want like a picture or screenshot about this? Quieren una screenshot? Yeah. Let me complete. What's up, group? Okay, let me take that ten the attendance. Again, voy a tomar la asistencia otra vez. Just to make sure that you are here, okay? Astrid Abigail. Aide. Romero de Guzmán. Brenda Elizabeth. Present. Cel Celina Janet. Present, teacher. Diana Carolina. Present. Evelyn del Carmen. Present. Griselda Jamilet. Griselda. Ya la vi. Isabel Rocío. Present. Carla Patricia. Carla, Lilian Elizabeth, Lilian, Elizabeth, Lilian, Lilian, ya ven, yo la veo conectada, pero no, no, no está presente. Ok, Luis América, América Rivas. Okay, uh, Natalie Marilyn. Present teacher. Manuel Alexander. Present. Oscar Eliseo. Roberto Antonio. I'm here. Okay, Sandra Jam uh, Jamilet. Present teacher. Verónica Guadalupe. Vero. Wendy, Judith. 
Present teacher. Xiomara. Present teacher. And Yanira Reyes. Okay, well, uh, 15 students. Okay, from 20, okay, está bien. Me faltan cinco. Okay, do you have questions about this? ¿Tienen preguntas acerca de estas reglas de aplic cómo aplicar en simple present? Sí, ¿No? pero una pregunta este dijo Carla o Karen, porque yo soy Karen Patricia, pero ¿y qué dijo Carla Patricia? Oh, perdón, entonces me equivoqué. Karen Patricia. Sí, así es Karen Patricia. Ok. Gracias. Muy bien, muy bien, thank you. Okay, we have a conversation to practice here. Uh, who wants to practice that conversation? Raise your hand. Ajá, levante su manita. ¿Quién quiere participar? Ok, Roberto. Está muy pequeño. No veo. No veo. Está muy pequeño. Estamos ciegos todos, teacher. <risa> Ay... Ok, vamos a ver si lo puedo hacer más grande. ¿Y ahora? Siempre pequeño. Es que mi teléfono lo, va, lo veo. Está Pero pequeño. en su teléfono lo puede agrandar usted. Ah, ahorita sí. Sí. Dale. Ok, thank you. Ok, Roberto and Isabel, go ahead. So, Sofia will be Isabel and Mario, uh, and Roberto will be Mario. What, what do you do every Monday morning? I check my email. And I call them for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to read a weekly report and at a meeting. I also have to organize meet meetings every Monday. How often do you check? Email. Do you check it every day? Yes, I do. Actually, I check. I check it once or twice a day. Great. It is important. Great. It's very important. Okay. Very good. Thank you so much. Someone else? Alguien más? Thank you, guys. Questions that you may have about these conversations? Okay. Brenda, do you want to participate? Yes. Okay. We have Brenda. Who else wants to uh, participate? ¿Quién más quiere participar with Brenda? Evelyn, do you mind? Okay. Okay. 
<laughs> okay, Brenda, you will be Sophia and Evelyn will be Mario. Go ahead. What did you do every Monday morning? I checked my email and I could clean for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to read a weekly report and at in a meeting. I also have to organize meetings every two Mondays. How often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. I check it once or twice a day. Great. It's very important. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, weekly. I have to read a weekly report. Okay, and attend a meeting. And attend a meeting. Okay. Also, I have to organize meetings every two mm -hmm. Mondays. Huh? Okay. Clients here. Clients. Clients. Mm -hmm. Actually. Okay. Do you have questions about this? Dialogue? Okay. No. Um, okay. I can. I question a uh, weekly. 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 Se es eh, a la semana. Okay, cada semana. Week es semana. Huh? Semanalmente. Semanalmente. Huh? What is the meaning attend a meet meeting? Attend a meeting. Mm -hmm. It is like the same if you attend this this meeting, this class, you attend the meeting. Yes. Attendance. Uh -huh. Asistencia. Mm -hmm. What else? ¿Qué más? Opting, opting, pop, opting. Often. Okay, es a menudo. How often? Cada cuánto? Okay, how often? Check. Okay. Sorry. Check. Check. Mm -hmm. Revisar. Chequear. Check it every day. Mm -hmm. What else? Oh. Mm -hmm. Okay, if you don't have questions, we're going to continue. Activities you do on Monday. On Mondays, I have como examples, okay? I check my emails, I type a letter, I write a report, I attend a meeting, I call clients, I, re I read a report, I visit clients, I organize meetings. Mm -hmm activities that you do on Mondays, okay? For tomorrow, I want that you think on activities that you do on Mondays, okay? Um, And we're going to have an, uh, an activity in class about that, okay? Describe what do you do in your workplace, okay? Also, you can describe what do you do in your house, but it, um. You can mix, pueden mezclar, okay? Activities that you do in your house and activities that you do on your workplace, okay? Write sentences about activities that you do on Monday or tomorrow, okay? So now we're going to um, 
This is a video that you already check. No problem, you already did that. So, okay, we're going to do this activity. Let me send the link to you. We are going to complete. So you have the link and let me send you also to the chat. Write three complete sentences using simple present tense. Try to answer this question. What do you do? every morning at workplace. Three sentences. For example, I write a report. That is an example, right? What do you do every morning at workplace? I uh I take my breakfast will be another example. I take my breakfast at eight a.m. I drink coffee. I drink coffee. Uh huh. I I drink water. Okay. Seleccionen una, 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 una sticky note. Aquí ustedes escriben. Okay. Y luego post, postean. Un ejemplo. Okay, examples. Todos tienen acceso, sí. A mí no me abrió. ¿Qué le aparece? No me la traduce el teléfono, la página. Mm, es que usted está del teléfono. Es que trabajo en la compu, pero los los ejercicios procuro hacerlos en el teléfono. Y no me los abre. Se lo mandé también al chat de, de, de Zoom. Ahí lo puede, puede darle clic en el chat y se lo va a abrir en la compu. <coughs> Write your name, please. Escriban su nombre para saber quién lo escribió. ¿Todos tienen acceso? O, bueno, solo la persona que, que me dijo que no. 
Dígame si ya lo pudo abrir de la compu. Sí, ya lo abrí, lo estoy intentando hacer. Ok, good. ¿Someone else? ¿Alguien más? ¿Todos tienen acceso o alguien más no tiene? A mí me deja. Ok, good. Muy bien. Write your name on it. Okay, escriban su nombre. Uh -huh. Escriban su nombre porque así voy a identificarlo. Si no, no, lo, no puedo identificar quién lo escribió. Ok. I review the information at 7 a.m. Medical Rivas. Ok. Good. What else do you do? ¿Qué más? Okay, do it like a homework because we don't have time. We have just two minutes. Okay, tenemos solo dos minutos. Háganlo como tarea y ahí tienen el link para que me lo me lo escriban. Okay. Um. Graciela, ok. Oh, ya eran tres. Oh. Me equivoqué, me faltaron dos. Ok. Ok, háganlo como tarea. Yo los voy a, los voy a estar revisando. Lo pueden hacer uh, después de la clase o mañana en la mañana. Ok, let me see. <clears throat> Teacher, pero ese link no lo puede mandar a WhatsApp, o ya lo mandó. Sí, se los envié. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Ok. Eh, mañana vamos a trabajar en la tarea número uno porque ya no tenemos tiempo. Si ustedes pueden trabajarla antes, trabajenla. Si no, mañana lo trabajamos al inicio de, de la clase, ok? La número oh, uno de la plataforma. Uh, well, thank you so much for your attention, okay, your attendance, for your participation. Los que se quieran quedar, se pueden quedar. Eh, les voy a ayudar a entrar a la plataforma. Los que tengan algún problema para entrar a la plataforma, okay? And the rest, thank you so much for your attendance today. This is the class number one. See you tomorrow. Okay. Okay, guys, take care. Have a good night. Yo sí necesito que me ayude a entrar a la plataforma, teacher. Okay, quédese. Have a good, good night. night. Yeah. The rest, bye. Good night. Good night. See you. See you tomorrow. Ok, eh, ¿sí tiene el link de la plataforma? 
Pero es que lo tiene en el teléfono. Es lo que le decía, que no sé cómo meterlo a la compu. Puede abrir su correo electrónico de la compu. Si ¿Sí lo puedo abrir. Sí. Porque está en el correo, ¿verdad? Sí, uh -huh. pero no me ubico cómo hacerlo, teacher, es la verdad. Mm, ese correo que usted usa aquí, digamos, para que le brinda a los, de, a los de inglés corporativo para que le manden la información, nunca lo ha abierto en su computadora. No. Ok, es, ¿de qué es el correo? ¿De, de Gmail? Sí, de Gmail. Ok, escriba en el buscador Gmail. Y ahí le va a dar la opción de buscar, de, de, de loguearse, de agregar su correo y su contraseña. En el buscador, en Google, escriba Gmail. ¿Sí la dejo? Lo estoy intentando. Ok. Le va a aparecer, uh, va, en la primera opción que le aparece que dice correo electrónico, eh, sin coste, privado y seguro, Google. Dele clic ahí y le da inicio de sesión. La parte superior le va a salir eso, que diga inicio de sesión. Le da inicio de sesión. Ay, piche, es que esta computadora la uso mi hijo, la usa mi hijo y, y créame que... Digamos que ellos tengan otro correo electrónico ahí. Le va, a, le va a salir usar otra cuenta. Le da clic ahí donde dice usar otra cuenta y ya escribe su correo. Y si no, dígale a su hija que le ayude a abrir la sesión de, de Gmail en la computadora para que usted así pueda entrar al correo que le enviaron y de ahí solo le da clic al link y ya le va a mandar a la plataforma. Pero sí, aquí... eso voy a hacer, teacher. Ay, disculpe que le estoy quitando de su tiempo. <ríe> no, 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 no hay problema. No hay problema. Pero, Pero si mañana bien. aún necesita ayuda, ok, me dice para que lo hagamos. Muchas gracias. Feliz okay. noche. Okay. Good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. Okay, bye.